Hi, my name is Yuki and I'm an archaeologist. I am here at the Valley of Kings in Egypt where lots of gigantic pyramids are located. I researched some information about pyramids and mummification, so I'm going to talk about that today. First of all, pyramids. Pyramids are tomb for the Egyptian kings, which is pharaohs. They took about 20 years to build one pyramid. Pyra they are roughly 50 to 60 meters tall, but one of the biggest pyramid, the Great Pyramid of Giza, is nearly 150 meters tall. Can you imagine it? And it was the highest structure until the 19th century. Then I had a thought about how did they make this such such big structure that could stand thousands of years. The answer comes from the base. The, the really wide base made all the weight of the stone rest on it. By widening the base, they could build the pyramid much more taller. That was the science behind the pyramid. Secondly, I was interested in mummification. The Egyptians believed in afterlife. They believed the soul had to keep its identity when it was alive. So they preserved the body to maintain its identity. That is mummification. There are several steps of mummification. First, wash the body with, the, with Natron. Natron is a compound made out of sodium carbonate and sodium bicarbonate, and they dry up li liquid and fats that cause the body to decay. Second, plug out all of the internal organs and bandage them and eventually put them into the jar and go with the mummy inside the pyramid. Third, leave the body stuffed with dry Natron for 40 days, and finally, when the body was completely dried up, you stuff in some natron and wrap it with resin soaked bandages and and put some herbs to smell it good. This was all for you guys about ancient Egypt. I hope you found something interesting in about ancient Egypt. I think ancient Egyptians were very distinct and unique minded. I am Yu Chan. It was nice to meeting you.